what to do with your leftover pie crust. I do have a video on that and I will link it up here, but I have another idea for you. So let me show you that one. Okay, so I rolled out the leftover pie crust and I have these little tiny cookie cutters. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut out, this is a little elephant, I'll cut him out, put him on a parchment lined pan. This is a, a little person. This is just a fun thing to do with pie crust. You have leftover, I mean, you can throw it away but it's more fun to use it up for fun little things like this. In the fall, I do these and I have leaf cutters, um, little leaf shapes and acorns, and, and they're also fun to put on your pie when you're making a fall pie. I've done pumpkin pies before and put, cut out little tiny pumpkins and uh, lined the crust with the pumpkins. I don't know, it's just a cute little detail. I love cute little things like that. I think I've mentioned that before. Now this is what they're, they look like on here. So what you want to do is you want to take a little bit of butter, you want to melt a little bit of butter in a little dish, it doesn't have to be a lot, and you just want to brush them just slightly. Okay, once they're all brushed to your liking, then you want to take some cinnamon and sugar and just sprinkle it. Just dust them. You don't want to go crazy with it, but you want to dust them up nicely. And bake them at 350 until they're nice and golden. And check these. So here are the little cookies, little pie crust cookies. They are so sweet. They're just firm. That's all you want. It's just firmly done. They've got all of the little, I don't know if you can see or not very well, but they've got all of the little cinnamon and sugar on them. They're just cute little bites, a cute little snack. It's fun. It's easy. I mean, you're just using your leftover pie crust, so you have it. So why not? make good use out of it. Waste not, want not. Isn't that what they used to say? In my grandmother's day, they didn't waste a thing. They used it all. It was important. You were feeding a lot of children. Families aren't as big as they used to be. I know my mom came from a family of 15 kids, so um, they didn't waste anything. And I like to follow that. I come from a family of six children and my mom was really good at making sure she used everything and uh, didn't waste anything. Um, I'm sure that was hard to do when you're teaming around six kids. <laughs> but this is just a little idea for you. A fun little treat. Uh, you can make them ahead. They're kind of like animal crackers, I think. and. Just store them in a jar in your pantry and they'll keep for a few days. If you want to store them in your fridge, you can do that too. They're a great grab and go snack for your kids. So I hope you try them. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you haven't subscribed, you can do that below and please leave me a thumbs up. And until next time. <laughs>